Thank you. Hey, Cheryl. Hi, Jamie. I'm so glad to be back with you. Thank you for having me once again. Oh, it's always my pleasure. I'm just waiting for Ron to cue me and we can start. Awesome. I hope you're well. I think I'm going to make it. <laughs> me too. <laughs> Today. Yeah. <laughs> well, you've seen our next guest as a judge on Master Chef, a competitor on Food Network Beat Body beat Bobby Flay, that's easy for me to say, and a guest on countless shows nationwide. Now, Chef Jamie Gwynn uh, shares delicious recipes for your July 4th, as well as this summer's best tips for entertaining. And if July 4th makes you think of standing over a hot grill all day, Chef Jamie will show us some ways that we can cool things down a bit. And she's going to share some refreshing beverage ideas. She always has good ideas on those. Savory eats, tasty treats, and time for your celebration. Hi, Chef Jamie. It's good to have you here. Yeah, I'm so glad to be back with you, Cheryl. Thank you. Yes, you know, with the patriotic holiday upcoming, this is a party in the USA. We're actually highlighting those states that are food fanatical. And I do have some ideas that will help you think outside the box, because with the heat wave going on, we are trying to stay cool. Right. So what do you have in mind? All right, so it might sound funny, but I say use your slow cooker. You know, the slow cooker itself cooks low and slow, right? But it doesn't add any ambient heat to the kitchen. So this is one of my favorite summer lunches for a crowd. This is a barbecue pulled turkey wrap, and it's a delicious combination of oven roasted turkey, creamy slaw and tangy pickles with all that barbecue goodness. To give it that rich flavor in patriotic style, I'm using the number one selling quarter slice turkey from Kentucky Legend. It's actually double smoked in Kentucky. It's ready to eat. And they offer a classic oven roasted turkey, a hickory smoked in a Cajun style. And while I use it for sandwiches, it's for so much more, but it really does create that sort of twist of flavor. Uh, I love Kentucky Legend and I love that they are so loyal to their state, of course. And then with it, I pair this side dish. And I think Cheryl, you're gonna love this because like me, you like a make ahead, right? The freshness oh, yeah. and flavor. Oh yeah, who doesn't? Uh, I love <laughs> a pasta salad and it really is packed with flavor. This is the Pearl's Olive Tortellini Salad. And it is really easy to make for a grilling get together. So people who love olives love and trust pearls. Both pearls, black, ripe, and green simply olives are 100% grown and packed in my home state, which is sunny California. And they're picked at the peak of freshness. Now, my son and I, we put black olives on all our fingers. Uh, one of the <laughs> things I love the most is that Pearls is committed to keeping jobs in the U.S. And what better than July 4th, the holiday weekend, to celebrate American companies, right? You always want to look for the sunny yellow packaging. But you know I'm an olive lover. So uh, this is right up my alley. That's <laughs> very good. So uh, right? it really does. Are there any other sides that you recommend? Uh, there, yes, there are. Thank you for asking. Um, I don't know if you've jumped on the air fryer bandwagon, Cheryl, but I love my air fryer for everything. It reheats leftovers uh, like a dream. Uh, it air fries everything as well, but it's also brilliant for sweet potato fries. Now, we are a sweet potato family. My son loves them, and the trend continues. Um, I look for North Carolina sweet potatoes. That's that party in the USA. North Carolina is the number one sweet potato producer in the US. And this year, the North Carolina Sweet Potato Commission is celebrating their 60th anniversary. They want everyone to be aware, and this is fascinating, that according to science, sweet potato is actually one word. Cheryl, who knew, right? <laughs> I did. I think it's, oh, you did. Oh, I love that you did. All right, they're nutrient Don't. dense, of course, vitamins A and no, C. I did you say you didn't or you did? I did not. Oh, I did not either. Okay, now we know. This is like dinner party conversation, right? Um, I love a sweet potato from North Carolina, low in calories, sweetened from the earth, long shelf life. I, I think they're perfect for every meal. Now, I have a cocktail and a dessert for you. Which do you want first? 
Oh, the cocktail. <laughs> yeah, my kind of girl. My kind of girl all the way. All right. If you're planning a beach day, a barbecue with family, Palm antioxidant super teas are the perfect refreshing companion for your summertime celebration. Now, you know Palm from Palm Wonderful, the pomegranate juice, but these Palm teas are a great grab and go beverage. They then elevate into a simple cocktail. Like wait till you see this Palm tea spritz that we're about to shake up. You can find the recipe, by the way, at palmwonderful.com. Now, each bottle of palm tea is gently brewed to preserve all the antioxidant goodness. I love the benefits of tea. But tea pairs really well with spirits, too. So wait till you taste this cocktail. It's bright with citrus. You'll love it. And then, last but not least, dessert is essential, necessary. We have to have it, right? And when it comes to dessert, you're going to think cheese. I know, it sounds crazy. I love cheese. Cheryl, you're a cheese lover? Yes, I am. Okay, I love Gouda on barbecue chicken tacos. I'm sure you love Parmesan on potatoes. But wait till you make this mixed berry trifle shortcake. It added, uh, it adds actually aged cheddar cheese to the traditional trifle recipe. And you get this combination of sweet and savory. You know how you have cheddar cheese on an apple pie in traditional style? This is like uh -huh. that, but better. So when you buy cheese, you always want to buy the best quality, of course. I look for the proudly Wisconsin cheese badge on the packaging. Because uh, as we celebrate the land of the free and the home of the brave, Wisconsin is the state of cheese. It's also the only state to require a license to make cheese. And it is the most awarded cheeses in the world, those that come from Wisconsin too. So you've got a party in the USA. You've got a little of everything to dig into. And I think that this guarantees a really scrumptious summer for sure. We've posted the recipes, by the way, at dailylounge.com so you can steal them. Okay, very good. <laughs> Jamie, it's always so much fun talking to you. Thanks for joining us today. Thank you for having me, Cheryl. A very happy, delicious, and safe holiday weekend to you. The same to you. Thank you kindly. And we'll be back. <laughs>